Elbridge Iyer Burbank, also known as E.A. Burbank, was born in Harvard, Illinois in 1858. After studying at the Chicago Art Academy, he received a commission to illustrate Northwest Magazine, essentially an advertising publishing to encourage homesteading. This commission brought Burbank through Montana, Idaho, and Washington, and fostered profound appreciation for the American West. After the completion of the Northwest Project, E.A. Burbank went to Munich, Germany to study, where he met J.H. Sharp and William R. Lee, who would remain lifelong friends. As did countless other artists who met Sharp, Burbank became focused on traveling and painting the Indian people of the Southwest. When he returned from Germany, he was hired by his uncle, Edward Eyre, the first president of the Field Columbian Museum, to paint portraits of the great Indian leaders of the day. E.A. Burbank took on the project and, once completed, did not stop, continuously traveling around the country, painting as many Native American subjects as he could. Burbank visited most of the Southwest Pueblos and early mission churches. These small paintings are little gems, snapshots of that moment in time at the end of the 19th century. All told, E.A. Burbank painted over 1,200 Indian portraits in his lifetime. His travels put him in contact with some of the prominent figures of the West, including Lorenzo Hubble and Geronimo. It is said that Geronimo said that he liked Burbank better than any other white man he ever met. Today, E.A. Burbank's work can be seen in the collections of the Newberry Library in Chicago, the Smithsonian, and the Field Museum, just to name a few. <laughs>